I heard it from you, son. <laughs> hey, I got a deal for you, son. What is it? I ain't never, ever give you the opportunity to go in the smokehouse and pick out whatever you want to eat no, for breakfast. No, I'm not going to do that. I ain't never done that. <laughs> That's a good idea. Give me that. That's a good idea. Give me that. All right, let's go. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. You got to pick out what you want. I can't walk without a stick. I can't need it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, let's see what we want. Son. I don't know. It ain't my business what we want. You have to pick it, son. Because yeah. this is Spring Friday. What do you think? What we want. It's full, Frank. It's full. It's going to be a hard decision, son. Yeah, it's true. There's a lot of bacon in there. You have to pick out which one you want. I mean, you don't you don't even have to choose bacon. I mean, I don't, it's your choice, son. No, no. Whatever you want. Well, if I don't want, I mean, you're there, I think. You ought to know what's in here. You come in here peeking around every night. <laughs> <laughs> son, uh, I think I think look at the sheer volume. You think you take that guy? Do you know what that is? That's a... No, we don't. <laughs> what is that? What do you think it is? Real? Nope. Pies? Nope. It ain't bacon. It is bacon. Yeah, but what kind? That's what you don't know. Oh. Macaligas? Nope. Oh, is that other kind? Yeah, that other kind. Yeah, okay. What do you think that other kind is? Uh, it's hanging there just a swing. Oh, uh, let me see. What is it? That a pig? Nope. No kind of pig. No pig whatsoever. No pig? Uh-uh. Coon? <laughs> coon bacon. No, it ain't coon, son. What well, is that bacon? They can't, they gotta be too much. Yeah. I don't know. I just take I just take You that. take it anyway. Yeah, okay, yeah. let's get it in slicer. Oh, let's get it in slicer. You ready, son? Yeah, what is it though, video? I got the place right here for you. Yeah, we're gonna see what it is. Mm. I mean you don't know my meat, you know. You don't know your meat, no, you know. I figure old oh, smokehouse connoisseur. <laughs> Baconator would know, son. No, son. Well, I'll be. This got to be white pork. <laughs> I thought I know. White if pork. Ain't, if it ain't that Mona Lisa or whatever. I can tell you right now, it ain't Mona Lisa. Let me cut it and see if you can tell what it is. You have eaten it before. I've fed it to you many times. Yeah. Mm. Mm. Turn it over, maybe be a little easier. Yeah. You cut it in fingers. That'd be good. <laughs> Tell what it is, son. Mm -mm. You can't taste it. You might know what it is. You taste it. If it ain't pig, it gotta be cow. There you go. If it ain't pig, it gotta be cow. And it's got to be beef. It's beef. It's beef. All right. That, my friend, is Big Louie. Yeah. Big Louie was one of them guys that loved to hang around the feed trough, son. Mm -hmm. He would eat literally all day long. <laughs> that is that's it. And time we got done with him, we had him worked up to five gallon of grain a day mm. and a wheelbarrow load of silage. Every day he ate that much, son. The only thing he had to deal with was the bull trying to chase him off, but 
he would just go around and eat the side where the bull had his food then. So he didn't miss a bite. He ate all he wanted. Ain't that amazing? Mm -hmm. And you can tell by looking, he didn't miss no meals. No, I did that. I don't Ain't that pretty though? Mm -hmm. Marbled up beautiful bacon. I can't believe it. Well, I can't believe it either. I mean, it just seemed like it, but I said, no, it can't be too. No? And I, you know, I got thinking, yeah, it got to be that bull. Huh. And you know, you know what's so funny about it? When we eat it like this, cured and not uncooked, it don't even taste that salty. Uh -uh. It's unreal how good it tastes when it is just cured only and not cooked. You wouldn't call it raw necessarily because it's cured. No. It's been hanging in this smokehouse for weeks. Well, I got to go and deliver some stuff. What, you got to use the bathroom? No, I got to go put up some stuff. Is that your pills? No, that's bread. Bread? He's a bread sneaker. Bread. He, he, uh, <laughs> he smuggles, he smuggles bread in here just about every day. That way, if I get hungry, I got bread and meat. Yeah. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> well, you know what I've noticed about about no. people your age, son? I wouldn't call them old, but people your age, they like their bread. <laughs> <laughs> Yuck. All right, I'm going to hang this up, and I'll be in there stop frying it, bubs. Okay, bubs. I'll be there to my fries, bubs. <laughs> <laughs> Ain't you, dude, folks? I mean... I ain't asking for sympathy, but you know it's a lot to put up with. <laughs> Let's go. Caleb, it shows the beef bacon. Beef bacon, beef bacon. That's what he wanted. That's what he said to him. You know what really hurts? You see an old, old man, and you think, boy, he's old. And then you realize you went to school together. <laughs> <laughs> All right, one thing we discovered about the beef bacon, we cured it real hard, so it got really salty, which is good. That means it won't go rancid. But it's too salty to eat without a lot of pain and suffering. So what we learned how to do, you don't have to soak it for days and days. All you gotta do is put water in your skillet and start out that way. And then we'll finish it off by frying it once we get a lot of this salt out. I'm gonna go a little more water. This uh, beef bacon tends to curl up quite a bit when it gets to when it gets to boil. So we're just gonna bring her over. In order to speed up the process, we're gonna take this eye off so that we have pure heat coming into that. That's what I call turning it on high. And of course, we're going to have to add some wood because it's down pretty low. Add some wood. Add wood. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. <laughs> and on top of that, I'm going to open up these bottom doors. Get that air flowing up through there. And before you know it, we're going to have some boiling water.
bacon. Be careful, son. It's hot. It'll burn your smacker, son. What do you think about it, son? Mm -hmm. Is it as good as you thought it'd be? Yeah. That's hot, son. Good. I ain't got false teeth. I can't just chew pure fire, son. Mm. My favorite part is that back in the middle where it gets kind of... Yeah. A lot of the grease boils out and it just turns into a net. And you eat that, man, crispy. Mm -hmm. Yes. Oh. But the meat's good too. Uh -huh. If you cook it hard enough, it's like beef jerky almost. That's right. It doesn't taste like it. Jerky bacon is what exactly what it tastes like. Mm -hmm. Bacon fun. Take your fork and get all you want. Then <laughs> they gonna dig in. Mm -hmm. It is good, son. It is good, dude. Matthew's gonna have to get him some. Mm. Come on, Joe. Mama's got the eggs ready, boys. Look out, here she comes. Here she comes, boys. She come She's an egg frying Bessie. Egg frying Bessie. <laughs> Oh, oh, look out. Oh, oh, look, oh, they saw me in my place. Look at you oh. done, you son. So good. Mm. Oh, my dear. My dear. Everybody wish Joel a happy birthday. He turns 19 today. Yeah, big 19. Mm -mm -mm. And that's hard to believe that he is. Caleb, I bet you can't believe you got a 19 year old brother. <laughs> Uh, man. I can't believe it myself. Mm. Camp dog. Camp dog seasoning on eggs is unreal good. You want some, Frank? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Ain't no mum, hon. Thank you. Oh, my goodness. Yes, sir. Yes, Thanks, dear. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Mommy punked me like I'm a punkin' bag. He is a punkin'. I'm gonna start calling him punkin'. I'm gonna tell you why, Beck. That camp dog make it mm -hmm. delicious, mm -hmm. man. Yeah, that camp dog. You need to put it on that job. Oh, man. Mm. Yeah. All right, folks, there you go. Frank Friday down the hatch. Hope you enjoyed it. It's the first time I've ever took him in there and let him have. Whatever he wanted. May never happen again, but he pretended like it was his birthday. <laughs> we hope he don't have too many more birthdays. He'll kill him. So we're going to get out of here. We hope you have a great day. We'll see you on the next video.